Hey guys, what's up? This is Steve from Sample Sound Review. Today we're checking out Kinetic Brass Motion Engine by Kirk Hunter Studios. This is a second Kinetic Motion based instrument. The other one was Kinetic Strings. And this brass sounds excellent you guys gotta check this out but let's check out the gui before i go into the uh, presets and the presets are similar to the kinetic strings they kind of give you a feel for what you what you have you got superman superman 2 captain america robocop you know superhero so it kind of gives you an idea of of what they sound like let's see to the left you have a choice between staccato mercato portato you can turn those off and just play the instrument you know just with no motion you can just play the instrument like it is with no motion So yeah, you can turn all those off at once. That's the sequence. These are the four sequencers. And it starts with the trumpets, French horns, trombones, tubas. And if you don't want one of them, you can just click on each one and stop the sequence that way. You can tighten the notes or broaden the notes. So if you really want a tight mix or, you know, kind of a, a longer note type, you can just broaden each one or tighten it, whatever you want. So. And this is like a global type of. You can broaden them all or adjust it down here. But if you have them all set. You can also draw in a sequence. Um, just like this. If you don't like the sequence that's playing, you can fully edit each sequence. Say we want to take the trumpets from a different, you know, sequence or preset whatever you want to call it so you can just switch them out and make something even more unique now here's your different notes you can change you can transpose now this is really cool guys you can actually do a midi drop drag and drop on this record some notes Then you hit that again, you can drag and drop right into your doll and edit it, add a new library, do whatever you want. Really cool that they have that option. So you can turn the global Sardini mutes on or off here and then just individually there. I'm a big fan of randomization and you have a global randomization here where you can randomize everything. And just uh, see what you get. And then if you just want to randomize each individual sequence, you can do so. You can also mute it, solo it. Right over here. You can favorite your own. You can save your own presets. Like go in here, save. And lastly, let's go to this part of the interface where you can have your different stages like you have dark and distant close bright sitting in viola section from the podium in the ice cave bone dry bone dry is just exactly what it is dry uh, and if you pick close bright 
or City and Viola section. Let me see. Where's Dark and Distant? Yeah, and you can adjust the... The mix of that just like this you can add more reverb here you can change the mic positions here EQ velocities and you can let's say you don't want the trumpets you can X those out they'll take that away um, French horns trombones so anything you don't want, you can exit out there. And then it, let's say you don't want any of these. Go back to there and it's all basically grayed out so you can't, you know, access it. Can't hear it. All right, that is it, guys. So guys, this just came out today. It's on an introductory price of $99. It will be going up to $149.99. So you actually save $50. All right, guys, stay with me. Subscribe to the channel. Let's check out the presets together.